The battery has two covers. The larger cover covers the top and side of the battery, red arrow, with the smaller cover on the fuse box mounted on the battery, yellow arrow. It has two circular plastic push button retaining clips built into the lid, one on each side, yellow arrow one shown. Push these in and pull the cover straight up and off the battery. The battery has a cable attached to each of the two terminals on it, the positive, yellow arrow, and the negative or ground cable, red arrow. Disconnect the negative or ground strap and place it somewhere where it cannot come back in contact with the battery. Disconnect the power strap from the main positive lead going to the fuse panel on the top of the battery. Under the main cover is the cover for the fuse panel on top of the battery. Squeeze in the two tabs, yellow arrows, and swing the cover towards the front of the car. Underneath the cover you will see the fuses for the generator, yellow arrow, interior relay, red arrow, coolant fan and control module, green arrow, fuel pump relay, purple arrow, and secondary air injector relay, blue arrow. The three smaller fuses are for the coolant fan, ABS system, and the ABS hydraulic pump. Squeeze in the two plastic clips on each side, yellow arrows, and swing the fuse panel up and back. Separate the fuse panel from the plastic mount, red arrow, it sits on, and tie it back up out of the way. Remove the main positive cable from the battery. Remove the 13 mm nut and plate, red arrow, on the lower front of the battery that holds the battery in position. Lift the battery from the car. Use care here as the battery is very heavy and you do not want to drop it or even have to tilt it over on its side. With the battery removed, unclip the two plastic clips, yellow arrows, on the plastic surround at the rear of the battery tray. Remove the tray and unclip the panel that holds the lines for the top fuse box, yellow arrow. You now have a clear battery tray area. Clean up any spilled acid or damage to the area, and installation is the reverse of removal. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and check out another video in this series.